Kanye West spotted with mystery woman weeks after missing. Kanye West is in the news again, and before you assume, no, he didn't get back his Twitter account. Ye was missing for a week? Don't worry, he was just out of headlines and social media posts for a few weeks. Now he is spotted with this mysterious woman. Who is she? And how is Kanye West related to her? Let's get to know more. Kanye West was laying low after the split from Kim Kardashian. However, he raised many controversies with his anti-semantic remarks, leading to his ban from the Bird app, Twitter. After Musk took over Twitter, Ye got his account back but was again banned because of his anti-semantic remarks. This put him under the media radar. There was news that Kanye West had gone missing. Not long ago, Kanye's former business manager reported that the 45-year-old rapper was missing, and he could not locate him for several weeks. Thomas St. John, Kanye's senior financial advisor, was suing him for non-payment. This was enough for the conspiracy theorists to come out of their nest and go wild. The internet came up with the wildest conspiracies, from kidnapping to Kanye turning to the saint. We have heard everything. According to a few reports, the senior finance advisor has asked for more time from the court to serve the lawsuit papers on Kanye West because he couldn't find the American rapper, his name as the defendant in the court documents. The court filing said they had been advised about a new law from the defendants. It was not a specific point of contact. Kanye has officially ended all these rumors with his public appearance, but he raised a new wave of conspiracies by appearing with a blonde woman. Isn't it crazy? Who is she? So, before ruining his career in the spiral of controversies and gossip, he was a talented musician. Kanye West was born in Atlanta and gained popularity as a producer of Rockefeller Records. He produced singles for many artists and developed a chipmunk soul sampling style. His desire to pursue a solo career was strong. He released his debut studio album in 2004, The College Dropout. His first album became a great commercial success. He founded the record music label Good Music in the same year. Recently, TMZ published a few pictures of Kanye West where he can be seen driving around Beverly Hills on the weekend in his expensive Maybach. Kanye is smiling behind the wheel, sitting next to the blonde woman, and it looks like he is having a good time with her. As per sources, the woman stepped out hand-in-hand hand with Kim Kardashian's ex-husband and walked into the Waldorf Astoria Hotel in Beverly Hills later in the day after parking the car. Pictures are now the internet's hot favorite topic and making rounds on all the celebrity gossip pages. The pictures of them holding hands is now viral, but the internet couldn't figure out who the woman is. Kanye started a huge controversy when he appeared at the Paris Fashion Week wearing a shirt that said White Lives Matter along with conservative political commentator Candace Owens. Many people, including his fans, criticized him for being insensitive and absolutely ignorant. You can't forget the statement made by Kanye like, you are being controlled by Jewish people. He was accused of being anti-semantic and was locked out of his Instagram. Later, he posted a clip where he sang with Mark Zuckerberg. It was his first post after being inactive on Twitter for almost two years. He posts a direct threat to Jewish people. Twitter banned the rapper for 24 hours. All this drama made brands pull away from Kanye West. He lost billions of dollars in the brand deals with Adida. Adida clarified that it doesn't support hate speech and condemn Kanye's recent actions. Adida called them unacceptable, hateful, and dangerous. They violate the company's diversity and inclusion. Kanye West's appearance on Infowars against created a hot buzz. He was seen wearing and praising Hitler. He discussed controversial subjects such as evil, sin, and many more. Ye is coming off a few weeks out of the limelight after he showed up at Mar-a-Lago. He went to Mar-a-Lago for dinner with Donald Trump and a white nationalist, Nick Fuentes. One can argue that this is the lowest point for the artist. After the infamous dinner, the singer is not very active on his social media handles, and what's more shocking is that he hasn't made much news about his controversial and stupid statements, which is one good thing that has happened to Earth if you ask me. It looks like he's trying to dodge a lawsuit from his former business manager because he is hard to find. Surprising. Now, Kanye West is back. Do you think he'll soon make the headlines with his statements? Let us know in the comments and make sure to like and subscribe to know more. Also, don't forget to hit the bell icon to never miss an update.